So what we did. Oh, okay. So it's not this building. It's the building in the back. Correct. Oh. So what and there's did, only one way to get here, which is to walk back here. Exactly. Oh. So they've got the fire escape so that it um, meets code. So, um, and it's one entrance in and out? Uh, correct. Well, yeah. And then the windows are the, the second. Okay. like out of state was that why you were managing for him yeah i mean he lived here before and then he moved out of state maybe like five years ago and at this point he's selling because he just wants to he's got his hand in a whole bunch of different businesses so that sounds... wants to simplify. um so let's see and the units for the heat and everything are in unit correct um so this one and the one below, same way out. This one and the one below, same way out, same finishes. Cool. How are you? Thank you. How's it going for you? Uh, thank you for, uh, no problem. for letting thank us in. How's it going? So there's a closet here. Oh. Here has a unit of laundry. Oh. Heater, furnace. And are all the one beds approximately the same size and all the two beds approximately the same size? So this one is about three feet shorter Got than it. the front one. Um, the whole the thesis was nobody likes sleeping in a closet, so I want to make sure everybody has a yeah. bedroom. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good size. Uh, <coughs> good size Thank you. No problem. Thank, Thank you so much. Problem. And when did the renovations get done? They started in 2016. It was 2016. Oh, okay, cool. We started like a couple months later. Is this building master key here? Yeah. This is Aaron. Hello. So, um, is this hardwood or vinyl? Hardwood. Oh, okay, cool. And the whole building is hardwood? Yeah. Cool. So um, did you guys refinish these or is it, are these new? So we put new hardwood down. Okay. okay. Um, the one thing that you'll see, so the building, so the floors when we bought the building were like slanted. Sure. So instead of, and that's why we brought the structural engineer to make sure that Shit wasn't still moving. Makes sense. Um, you can see like yeah. the the ceiling line kind of comes down a little bit. We just yep. we didn't do anything with that. We just leveled the floors. Yeah. Um, and so the fr uh, the rear one that we just saw it's about three feet shorter, so we only have a back wall of cabinets. This one has the curb around. Yeah. You can see a little bit bigger bedroom too. And what did the uh, structural engineer say? Um, said the, um, I think the previous owner added a, um, forgetting my, uh, terminology. They basically added the, the center, um, joints support. Yeah. The center support. Yeah. Uh, that there, there wasn't like any kind of activation. This 
one we're at for seventeen twenty-five. The one we were just at that's for sixteen seventy-five. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and as far as like turnover goes, I'd say the average tenant stays by around two years. We had so the rear downstairs was a couple people took about four years. Um, the ground front in the building, the ground up. Two beds are on the first floor? Correct. The uh, they're in the front building. In the front building, okay. Let me check that out. Uh, yeah, if you were my cat, I'd have a statue after me too, right? If you were a cat too? No, no, I know. If it was, uh, I would definitely make a statue of it. Uh, yes. <laughs> Post it outside so everybody can see it too. Mm -hmm. It's a good cat. It's a, same exact. <coughs> closet, washer, dryer, yeah. um, bedroom, closets, more closets. No, I like it. In bed, old windows. This is the darkest unit out of the four because it's in the back. And how much was the per unit renovation cost out of curiosity? Okay. I have to look. Okay. I could go a lot less than it was right now. Sure. Yeah. Um, I'd have to look. I can't remember right off the top of my head. You're all good? Dress up against this uh, wall, except the curtain. Cool. These gas meters for these? Yeah. I really should master. That was too flat, and I got a quote when I bought it for like 700 bucks, and I was like, "Oh, screw that! It's too much." And every day after that, I've been like, "Gosh, you just <laughs> crush it!" <Yeah. laughs> There's one if you have like a uh, like I have a really nice like uh, guy that's not that expensive. But, uh, he's an older guy. Uh, they sell the sets which you can master key yourself oh. at like Home Depot or whatever. Yeah, yeah. So, hey, it's Aaron. Yeah. But, um, how's it going? Good, how are you? The locks are right. cheap. So, okay, we come in? Of course, yeah. I would like to take your shoes off. Oh, yes, please. Okay, cool. <coughs> yeah. Take your shoes sure. off. No problem. Thank you. Thank you. All right. 
So if I'm getting this layout right, it's this building and what's the outside? Where's the second? Oh, so you do own the brick building in the, over there. Yeah. Oh, okay. Because I was like, oh, okay, let's let's go to this one. I was like, all right. And then I was like, oh, okay. Uh, okay, very nice. Okay, let's yeah. go check that one out. Cool. <coughs> very, very nice. Is this existing? Yeah. Okay. This would be Did you okay. review the porches as well? Um we didn't have to. Okay, yeah, no, they look pretty good. Yeah. Um so there's an electric room here which I'll show you guys. Yeah. So check that out. And uh, the other building is also individually metered? Yes. And then you uh, uh, only these have central ACs, or just all of them? Everybody does. Oh, okay. Yeah. Where, oh, oh, I see. Okay, got it, got it. Okay. Got it. Yeah. Okay, got it. Yeah. Okay. 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 I'm assuming the other ones are on the roof. Oh, no, I guess not. Uh, yeah, they're all here. Just hope to God that one doesn't break down. Oh, they're breaking down. Even the ones in the back? The compressors are up here? The back units? Yeah, oh. yeah. There's, there's seven down here. Um, give me just a second. Let me open the door and then I'll let you You're all good. You're all good. Yeah, usually they don't want to run like, I don't know, it's that far. But... Yeah, you got like 40 tons of free on or whatever. But, you know. Yeah. Maybe that's why. Yeah. Maybe it's not on operation. Maybe yeah. It's just like more stuff. So in Rogers Park, I redid that new cooling, and they didn't put the Freon in there until uh, until the summer because we did it in the winter. Um, all right, so we're, we're going here. Yeah. Oh. All right. Oh, okay. Oh, there's the electric one. Got it. Let's check it out. All right. Um. Yep, looks like it. Four amps and 60 amps running on it. Oh, yeah. and these are all the service disconnect. How many amps are coming into the building is a good question, too. Oh, yeah. What's the amperage for each unit? 100. 100? 100. 100. 100. 100. Yeah. Yeah. Probably 100. Two would be a lot for, <laughs> for this moment. I think it's right. probably 100. Cool. Alright. Then what we'll do next is we'll hike all the way to the top. Yep. And I'll show you the attic up there. Sounds like a plan. Are we gonna be able to get into a two bed as well? Oh yeah. We're oh. Gonna get all of them. Love it. Cool. Guess we can go ahead and head down there. Oh. I forgot to show you the front building's attic. Um, it's just it's off. We didn't put any uh, utilities up there. We, it's just totally Yeah. Um, this one, though, is, is nicer. And so we <laughs> give everybody a key to use it as storage if they want. Makes sense. Yeah. So I'm getting a, we got a building in Bella Park too. And I'm getting the roof done. And uh, the good news was insurance covers it. The bad news is they don't cover the wood or whatever. So you got to get like the wood slats, but it's like a hundred bucks for each. This doesn't look terrible. This looks pretty good. Yeah. This is like our uh, Indianapolis building, um, 4912. Uh, okay, so you got some insulation up here. So the third floors. Did you insulate? In here. Got it. Did you insulate the ceilings of the floors down there, or is it just coming up? Um, we did not insulate. Um, this one is insulated, but from 
ground to first and first to second. We just but over here, it's insulated from. Yeah. Oh, okay, got the it. Third dog, yeah. Okay. Um, third floor, the previous tenant who lived here put some workout equipment in this front room. Back when we lived here. Yeah, I mean it's Wicker Park. You could, you could like uh. If you wanted to figure out a way. If you to wanted to figure out a yeah, unit. possibly, and just fight the city and fight everybody. This looks like it's done right. And this is the furnace. Uh, the furnace is right there. Yeah, yeah. Um. That looks right. That's. Yeah, it looks pretty good. So, like redoing like the heating for like a big house is a big project because you got to figure out a way to. Uh, that, that, that's what I was saying. Like you can kind of do it. Like this is done right, um, but this is really cheap and really easy because you just have a big one. It splits off to one small one. That splits off yeah. to one small one, and like it's easier to do. We did uh, like at the three level house in Rogers Park, and like. Once you get three levels and like 3,000 square feet, you have to figure out math of like vents and everything else. Mm -hmm. Here, it's like just get a big ass vent and like the heat will travel and you'll be okay. Mm -hmm. But that was, that was a project. That was really expensive project. Uh, okay. Filters there. The returns are somewhere over there. And um, there's one whole return. Yeah, you can get away with that for a department. You can get... <coughs> <coughs> Going. It's going up. Doesn't look like there's any leaks. Alright, we're good. Cool. Sweet. And then in a big house, you got to figure out returns in every room and all that, too. Here, you can get away with just one and you'll live, especially if it's like an 800 square foot two bed. Um, and then since the front building doesn't have an attic, we yep. told them, like, you can put chairs up here, yep. put a grill up here. And there's no common area electric in this one, correct? Uh, no, um, there is. It's the f there's like a front light. Okay, got it. And the baseboard heat. Baseboard heat. Okay, there's a baseboard heat for this apartment as well. No, that was for the crawl space. Okay, for the crawl space. For the crawl space over there, how many meters does that building have? Um, it's four meters, and then a public meter. D does that one have a public meter or no? Um, it, the, the common meter is yes. the baseboard heat and then the light. Got it. So there's five meters total in that building? I don't know where the, f I, I don't know if there's a fourth meter here or there might be. Got it. Um, I'll go check it out. Yeah. yeah. All I know is we've got a, um, we get a comment for the one Yeah. Manager. Got it. Yeah. Oh, okay. So... This one looks like it was done. Yeah, this one was too, but it's just they, you know, they put a new one. Yeah. So it looks like there's only one layer on these. Yeah. Like another full layer. Yep. Well. Okay. Which is, yeah, you know, the next okay. one probably needs to be turned. Yeah. <laughs> is there a crawl space in this one as well or no? Um, it's, it's like a two or three foot crawl. Got it. But it's accessible through the garden unit. Like in one of the bedrooms, there's like a lift up hatch. Okay. Hey, good, how are you? Good, I'm still okay? Yeah, you're good. Mm -hmm. He's in there, but you can walk in there and find something. Oh, cool. Um, oh, no, I'm in your shoes. Do you leave? Don't worry about it. Okay. So, let's see here. Yeah, you'll see the layout upstairs too. Yeah. 
guys here, furnace is there, and then there's a tankless water here. Tankless water here. And that goes out to the electrical room back there. So once upon a time, Boston was just really terrible. Now it's new development everywhere. Yeah. Um, the exposed brick wall, like they would have apartments that hadn't been renovated in like forever. But that was apparently like a selling point. It's like, look at that beautiful exposed brick wall. And oh my god, this is yeah. janky. That's the <coughs> I would only want it if it was not an exterior. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, is there any way we can see the hatch? Open the hatch and it's in that bedroom down there. Oh, so okay. Got it. Okay. You want to come back? Yes. Um, it, it's just it's unfinished, kind yeah. of like the back building. Yeah. I'm just wondering if there's water coming in because the floors are like like if they're new, they're a little kind of wavy. I think there's moisture. I believe we yeah. put down a moisture barrier under there, but okay. then they nailed down the floor. So. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Moisture barrier underneath the. Okay, got it. Got it. Mm -hmm. That's not really. You can use that dry lock stuff too, and that's, that's really good. Um, it's like the paint, basically. Mm -hmm. yeah, so. Oops. Oh, And all the bedrooms are like the same size, the two beds, roughly? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Right, let's go check out the other one.
Hey, Darren. We can't talk, he's gonna be in a work call. Oh, yeah, sure. So just be really quiet. Um, Let me go. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Do you want me to take shoes off here? Yes. Okay.